Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, Sino Netic. Today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make a backup, which is very recommended in case you lose your data on TV Mate, the app gets deleted, or your TV or Google device needs to be reinstalled. With that backup, you can save all your channels, your favorites, your playlists, etc. The only thing that doesn't get saved is your login details from your TV Mate premium in case of a uh, backup and reinstalling of TV Mate. So that's the only thing you need to re-log in. Besides that, everything else will be saved in the backup. So that's pretty cool. I'm going to show you guys how to do it. So stick around to find out how. Before I get started, uh, this video is made for educational purposes only. I will not be using any illegal IPTV services. I don't recommend anyone doing that either if you find value in this video please smash the like button and start following my channel okay let's go and open up tv mate okay when you're in tv mate we're gonna press the ok button You press the OK button, we're going to hit the left navigation button. You will go enter into settings after pressing OK. You won't see it because my camera is in front of it, but it is there. And what we're going to do now is hit general. And we're going to go back all the way down. And we're going to press on backup data. Okay, now you have the option to select where you want to save it. And I'm just going to save it up here in Downloads folder. Okay, select. And what it's doing now, it's creating the backup. So in case of a reinstallment of the application, uh, all you have to do is, I will see, show you in the next steps, but in case of a reinstallment of the TV, you would have to save the backup on a USB stick. So I'm just going to show you guys also how to do that fast. Uh, uh, it's actually very easy you just put a usb stick in your tv if you have an android or google tv like a sony or a philips tv in case of a uh, google chromecast uh, uh, 4k like this device here i'm not showing it very good you will need a uh, usb hub because it only has one usb port c so you would need a usb c port hub with a power option because uh that's also how it would power the device so the hub would have multiple usb c ports with one also powering the hub and the google home and with that you can stick a usb stick in it fast and just back up the data there so in this case i would go to backup data and i will hit the folder button up and you'll see here it says internal storage if you add a usb stick in a device or tv you will see it here. So that's pretty important to keep in consideration. Okay, so after making a backup and uh, you've reinstalled the device, the application, you would go back here and uh, the first thing you would have to do is log in your TV Mate Premium, which I recommend everyone purchasing. It's a one time uh, uh, offer for 28 euros. After logging in, you can go to general again and you can go all the way down and you can hit on restore data. And from here, you can either select from local backup and in case it's in the download folder, you can back it up there. I would recommend doing it on the USB stick and in the download folder. And once every time, just backing it up, rewriting it. So if you change your favorite list, etc., that it will also get saved. So in this case, uh, the USB stick would be here and download folder would be here and all i'd have to do is just press the ok button as you can see i have multiple backups okay last thing i want to show you is you can also uh, back it up on a google drive for instance if you've set it up on a usb stick you saved it there and you run to your computer you put it in your drive folder or your dropbox folder you can enter the url here through your google home application or manual which i don't recommend and in that case you won't need the usb stick anymore yes also i forgot to mention that you'll also have the option to backup data through the smb 
which is a server message block uh, which you can wirelessly transfer to your windows computer you'd have to require some steps to do this so i won't be getting down to this today that's a bit too much technical uh, this all the easy uh, and fast methods that i've shown you so if that's about it i hope you like this i hope you found the video interesting if you if it does then please smash the like button and start following my channel thank you for watching until next time goodbye